renewable energy courses. Um, they're aimed at tradespeople, so these are post-trade qualifications. They have to have a trade to actually do them, and it's a requirement of usually the licensing bodies that they have these qualifications to get a licence. So that's what we've tended to focus on, licensing outcomes. And my name's Dean Taylor. Um, I've attended two courses with SkillBuild, um, one being the battery storage endorsement and the other one being the standalone power systems. The battery storage endorsement here at SkillBuild was uh, absolutely excellent. Um, not only the classroom side of it, but we did a lot of hands-on stuff. I've done a lot of other courses on previous occasions with other trainers, um, and it's a lot of classroom-based things. We don't do so much hands-on stuff. Bill's a great trainer, he's full of knowledge. I enjoy working on systems that I haven't worked on before. Spending a bit of time here today um, with the rep from SP too has helped out heaps. I've learnt more in two hours sort of thing than, than, I, than I ever knew, so yeah, fantastic. My name's Rob Moss, I'm here to help training on this battery session. we will be teaching them about um, how to design batteries and making aware of what important parts of batteries that people are generally unaware of is one of the things that I find is really important to convey so that they reduce their commercial risk in the field. My role as um, a product specialist will be to watch what they're doing and be the resource when they need help on some of those issues. I'm from Albury, uh, electrician, uh, doing the course to further education and, and to understand more about batteries and their impact in society. Because we're electricians, tradesmen and we're doing the installations, we need to learn the practical side more so than, uh, than just the theory. Learn a lot of uh, dangers and, and safety issues with batteries uh, and how they work in, in domestic installations and commercial as well. My name's Luke Pickles and I'm a trainer for SkillBuild. SkillBuild only wants to have people who are actually actively um, doing the sort of work that they're training on, which um, I think is, is more valuable than, than almost anything really. It's great to have theoretical knowledge and that's important, but you need the hands-on when you're talking to tradespeople. For my background, uh, I'm an electrical contractor. I'm also an electrician. I'm an installer for straight Grid Connect, as well as Grid Connect with batteries and also standalone. My full-time job is a technical and compliance specialist for the peak body for renewable energy in the country. And so through that, um, we see some of the ongoing issues that are in place in the industry, the sorts of things that electrical safety regulators are looking for, sort of thing that the clean energy regulator is looking for, uh, new trends, uh, new standards that are being written, that are being published, and those sorts of, I suppose, uh, insider bits of information which are really useful for being able to share that sort of knowledge with our students. So one additional thing about skill build is that they will schedule their training dates around the attendees, which is uh, quite useful, um, particularly for those that run their own business. Uh, it's a four day course, and so far we're three days in, and it normally runs over the weekend, so you don't lose too many days at work. I'm a very visual person, so seeing it visually is a lot easier for me, I think. Yeah, I really like the practical side of it. We pretty much wired up a whole system, from start to finish. Um, on the training boards here, we've got all the latest technology here, which is good, because you want to be up to date, and um, yeah, pretty much learning everything you need to know so you can do your own jobs. Favourable things also about attending the course is you get to network with other guys in similar situations. You've got guys that have been doing solar for them you know, 10 years and you've got guys who are just starting. So it gives everyone um, the opportunity to network with one another. There's a lot of business cards that get changed places. Um, you feed off a lot of information as well, which is really helpful. We always discuss problems and issues that we've come across. So um, yeah, it does help out quite a bit. Yeah.